ZSF finally tracked down the terrorists to this location. For their sake, they really wish they had. You're still here, huh? Pity. I bet Diaz a hundred that you'd be dead by now. Funny man, Specialist Peter Moretti. He's gonna help you understand how much of a badass motherfucker you are now. But remember, we still don't have the last piece of the puzzle. How in the hell they got the explosives on board the train? So we're clear? When this is over? You owe me a hundred. Back to business. As you know, one of the perks of being Black Ops is having access to the latest in experimental weaponry. Firearms may be your go-to choice for a weapon in a fight. But with DNI, your mind truly is your greatest weapon. Let's do some damage. Are you, do you have like psychic abilities or some shit? You're gonna have to explain this one. Okay, that pretty much looked like psychic abilities. <laughs> Not bad, new blood. You got a new cyber ability to play with. Immolation. You can spit on those enemies ahead. Watch them oh, I set him on fire! Nice! And I can just do that any fucking time to anybody? That's neat. Alright. Also, you're not getting a hundred just because you sucked at making your bets. <laughs> I hope I can, like, change abilities in the middle of the map- the rounds, or the levels, so I can just be like, Alright, I wanna burn people for a few seconds. Is there any reason to not have this thing on? <laughs> like, the tack mode? <laughs> I asked the question and then it was answered. All right. It's even done in a more convenient menu than I was imagining. It's just basically like Christ. Bloop. Bloop. Of course, I probably won't use these, uh, those nanos fly things all that much. I mean, if I can just do lots of shooting, it works out. <laughs> Enemies die a little bit faster than waiting for them to get killed by f nanobot flies. The more abilities you have, the more fun you can have. Try switching between them. Oh, I'm sad. It said press you to cycle, and I was like, ooh, can I quick swap between abilities? Nope. It just opens up the menu, as always. You know, I think I prefer the, the immolation thing a little bit more. <laughs> it insta-kills them, pretty much. Ooh, what is this? Hey! An actual loadout thing! And I can choose what weapons I want to use. Nice! Field op kit. Oh, okay. The field ops kit is, I guess, the recommended thing for that level. Intriguing. Okay. We're gonna have to go through and kind of sort through these, see what I can grab. Oh, can I not customize them immediately? Oh, That makes me sad. Alright, whatever. We'll just stick with this, I suppose. They're using smoke grenades. Switching to your EV helps whenever you're blind, whether in the dark or in smoke. Ah, there we go. Now you never have to worry about what's lurking in the darkness. So the other little eye the eyeball thing wasn't a cloak indication, it was actually just a night vision or tactical vision kind of thing. Alright. Well, we're gonna run back real quick because I actually do not like the burst wire fire weapon, as I said. So, how about that... Kuda? <laughs> I 
It's an automatic, so I prefer it. I want a new cool takedowns too! <laughs> I was hoping there'd be, like, a little tutorial there. You can use your new augments to actually take down everybody with only your hands. I mean, I guess technically that's what I'm doing anyways. Oh, hello. Okay, so I had to swap back and forth between the tactical mode and the tactical vision. Those are the options. Whoops, I, I think I just- nope, nope, never mind. I was gonna say, I think I just did immolation. <laughs> but I'm seeing the flies go around the area, so we're good. Oh, that's a lot of dudes. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I wasn't expecting, like, four fucking robots to just jump down and murder my ass. <laughs> Did that actually blind the robot? No. <laughs> I tried, man. I tried. Man, these fucking robots really mess up my day. <laughs> I mean, the entire zone that's over here is indicated as a kill zone, so that's my own fault. I'm just gonna hide. Everything's gonna be fine. Holy shit. You know, I'm surprised that the... Tactical vision shit doesn't actually like show you how long you your grenade's been cooked. Yeah, I don't think so Woo! <laughs> He almost fucking rock and socked me It was just a little drone. Those things aren't that much of a threat, are they? They probably are, but... <laughs> Hounds. Oh, those things. I can hack them, right? Oh, wait. <laughs> That's an actual ability. That's what I had to realize. Okay. Yeah, that's just a awful thing to have. <laughs> Holy crap. Guess what time I'm just gonna be going around the side so I can get a little bit closer to the action. I probably shouldn't get close to the action, but whatever. You know, it's a sad day when you can throw a grenade directly back into the middle of a group and it doesn't kill any of them. See? What is this shit? I mean, I guess it stuns them, which is a plus, but still disappointing. Mother of fucking shit, man. <laughs> uh.
This game's got some of the problem, same problems with as all other fucking Call of Duties. Which is to say, you have to fight against like 50 fucking enemies. Literally all of them are shooting at you. And you have, you have like a fucking AI buddy who's supposed to be shooting them and helping you. And maybe sometimes he'll occasionally get a kill, but most of the motherfucking time, nah. And this isn't a problem too badly in the older Call of Duties because you're like, well, I'm not a super badass super soldier. I'm supposed to be hiding back here. But we haven't even been introduced to the fact that we can double jump and speed around the goddamn place yet. We have fucking wall running, little abilities like that. <laughs> but bullets are still my only weakness. Keep it up. I should have grabbed a sniper. I'm about to die in, like, the same fucking place, man. To the same fucking place, like, the exact same bots. I'm starting to like you. One, two, three... Okay. <laughs> I wanted to see... If it fucking popped up the option or not, or the, the notification for jump cutting. Alright, fucking, oh my god. Oh, hi there, enemy that just suddenly popped Kick up. up. <laughs> Are all the robots gonna spawn again? We're just gonna... Nope, we, we're not gonna actually emulate them. That's disappointing. Are they all dead already? Nope, dead, dead, dead right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I finally clear out most of the goddamn room with a sniper rifle and ah, I rub out of my face. That'd be my own fault. Good hunting. Interface with that door for me. Alright! So we've learned many things, such as the fact that the sniper is really goddamn good. <laughs> and the robots go down way faster with the sniper rifle than anything else, so we're probably gonna keep on using this. What is this place? This... This is where it all went down. The computer over there should give us some insight into how they got the explosives on board. Go interface. Oh boy. <laughs> there are robots all around in this room. That's never a good sign. They hacked the security robots. They brought the explosives on board. You wanna hear something ironic? The reality was, the terrorist attacks actually accelerated the development of the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. If it wasn't for the fear of attacks like this one, we probably wouldn't even have the Cyber Soldier Program. Hang in there. 725. Got about five minutes. Okay, I gotta go shoot some robots and stop an explosion. New blood. Let's see if you can change history. All robots should be considered hostile. Trust me. They'll consider you too much. Take down is another one of your cyber abilities. Try it out on those bots. Watch your flank. They're coming through the windows. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, goddamn blood, Christ. You can change history. All robots should be considered hostile. Trust me, they'll consider you as much. Take down as another one of your cyber abilities. Try it out on those bots. Watch your flank. They're coming through the windows. That's how you take it. Yeah, Press B to do an instant takedown. Stops doing instant takedown. It's because it's one of my abilities. And so I have to wait for it to reactivate. Although it looks like it can take on two at the same time, so that's nice. Hey, how you doing? You guys are all gonna get blown up. Ow, 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 ow. If this shit was real, you'd be killing civs left and right. 
I'm just seeing what's gonna happen with them. <laughs> I'm going upstairs. Why not, right? What's going on up here? Not much. This is a nice fucking train. Look how goddamn spacious this th this is. Oh my god. We'll be lucky if we get cool trains like this in the future. Nice take down. Right on the button. Uh oh. Okay. okay. <laughs> I got a little worried about things raising up in front of me. I was like, oh god, I'm gonna die. Use concussive wave to take out a group of hostiles at once. The what a what? Ooh, concussive blast kills close enemies and knocks down other ones. Alright. Hey, this is an interesting vehicle. <laughs> Will we ever be able to get to use this ourselves? That'd be cool. Oh, I think there's someone still alive. No. No, never mind. Maybe I have to use concussive wave on the door. Not at all. What the fuck? Nothing else is popping up. Maybe I climb up. Aha, here we go. All right, I'm trying. It's just that five to seven robots shooting at me all at the same time on hard and difficulty is uh, a little bit of a trouble zone. I will never, ever play this game on realistic or veteran. Fuck that shit. <laughs> Cause this is how you're gonna play the veteran in realistic mode. Okay. Alright. Hello. Hello? Hello. Keep pushing up. You've almost located the explosive. Yeah. That's how you take an enemy down fast. That's a lot of dudes. Here, have a have a grenade! Have two more grenades. Like actual ones. Fuck me, grenades are so disappointing in this. At least against robots. Door, 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 door. Oh, there's still someone left. Okay. <laughs> He's just crawling away. Thing's booby trap. If I hack it, try to move it, or detach the car, it's gonna blow. It's too much. Even with the computer in my head, there's not enough time. It's actually very simple. Wait. This is a maglev trap. If I reverse the polarity on just this car. no way to stop it and get off the train. Your DNI might show you all the options, but only you can decide what you're willing to sacrifice. Sometimes, you have to let go. Taylor, how's our patient? As good as can be expected. I expect better. You should know that. Welcome back. Being prepped for surgery now. It's gonna be okay. Hendrix wasn't even injured on the mission. He volunteered for this. Oh, that's good. I can get a little buddy. <laughs> Want to join me as we become super soldiers in real life and not just a virtual training mission. Hopefully I do better in the real missions than the virtual ones. <laughs>